What am I looking at? What type of art is this? Incredible cheese bun. It's in cheddar. No, it's incredible. <laughs> We're here at Gallery 400 for the MFA show. Called A Strange House in My Voice. Well, it's a couple from 1950s, but they're both ginormous. How do you know there's queen size? Because we got two pillows. Two pillows. Twin? That's one pillow. These could be tiny beds and those could be tampons. It's because I have a tampon in now. I thought it was like they were trying to, you know, mess with the light. Does it, does it or does it not need more sense? Like, you look like, yeah. look at those and I go, those. Areolis. I know it's areolas, I like calling them areolis. Okay. That's what I ask myself when I look at anything, I'm like, would I hang it in my house? Does it need more sense? <laughs> would I hang, I hang it in my, my house? house? <laughs> you got, if you can find breath in here, then I'm going to be impressed. So this is like a sexual one as well, though? Yeah, found it yet. See, this big, saggy, old Oh, God, God. Oh, no. I think my eyes are. You shouldn't recognize it that quickly. I'll touch it and it would be like one. If I get electrified, I'm gonna They made us think about it. I, I think that was the idea. Can you um, identify that flower? I was greenhouse keeper in rehab. I like that you're the kind of person who was just tacked in rehab on the end of a sentence. Again, it explains why you recognize the electro shock then. <laughs> What happens here? You walk around this room once, and they just they give you an MFA on the way out. Are you fucking kidding me? Right? <laughs> they got some bike stuff going on. Basketball, I love basketball. Loving basketball, great movie. Who's in that? Yeah, the two greatest bicycle movies of all time are Premium Rush and The Bicycle Kid. That I think my girl. I love how they rode their bike together. I don't think why I didn't make it an improv. <laughs> Do you pedal with your hands? Do you think this is just? To, to lure in unsuspecting burglars, fiddling around with this fake safe. Could be a bus, I think, possibly. Oh, uh, yep, titty ring. So if you wanted to buy this piece of work, just bring in a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Dustbuster, man. There were more tits, and there was a picture of like Johnny Cash's head on this side of it. Johnny Cash shoots you with the, with the awesome tunes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, like that song, I Shot a Man in Reno with My Awesome Tunes, <laughs> just to watch him dance. We're here at Corbett versus Dempsey. For for everyone a garden by David Hart. Do you want to make some cheese predictions? Brie is popular, but it gets eaten quickly. By you, when you take all of it. Uh, Are you like by chance going to be meeting someone here tonight? I'm, I'm not going to be meeting anyone here. Okay, because our uncle was waiting for someone to meet, and he does a lot of films, so I thought you guys would like this one. She thinks you're her uncle's blind date. So what is that thing that happened where everybody was going around with the signs and they're saying mad, the 1%? Or... This is like the Occupy, but it's like go green. Spontaneous acts of revolt forming everywhere must find a tactic that takes into account the spectacle power of recuperation. I don't think that means that. You, you think the cat said it? He looks so cool, but he's alone in his apartment with his cat. Yeah. Uh, around with a bloke who says stuff like that. Yeah. Are you going, are you going inside? You said there wasn't enough tits in this. Someone touch me yeah, one. I feel like I kind of want to hold someone's hand. Oh, I'll hold your hand. I'm burnt. Look at all the tits in that. Now, I see vaginas right. and tits in that. I think I'm about fucked with a wolf ball bat, yeah. Are they known for being fucked? My daddy says that all the time. Yeah, a wolf ball bat got all holes in it. shit. No, the whip a ball has holes in it. Well, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> you have a point. Oh. Hey, Diddy, what's that thing you would say about, like, being fucked as a wiffle ball bat? Ain't that what you always said? Being fucked as a wiffle ball bat, yep. It's one of those bats where you play wiffle ball, you know, it's, uh, uh, the bat has got a hole uh, in it. Uh, <laughs> We're here at Yohala Project. We're Todd Diedrich, Luminous Flux. I want to be neon Jesus saves, and I want them to like blink on and off, kind of like a sequel. And then Kanye West walks out of these doors. 
Well, like, that's right. Man, environment's a hot topic these days. It's about we ain't teaching our children enough about how to save the earth. Are you sure it's not about just having a room in a car? Is it's, that a gang sign? Actually, I'm guessing there with the wood. Haven't you ever watched a Tupac or Biggie documentary? It looks like that thing when you make a vagina out of your hands. Uh, really how do you do that again? <laughs> Did you know how to do that? What? Oh, blood? That does not look like blood. No, that says blood. That, now says, that says blood in Arabic. Like that? There you go. Like, now that's blood. Jesus walks. How do you get that look? Well, you have to get a lot. Uh, 30,000 hand jobs. I'm sorry, don't put that in there. Is there like Count the Tree by its rings? It's Will Smith and Mark Lawrence. It's the, it's the first bad boys. Woosa. If you ever want to know about Martin Lawrence movies. Hi, we're here for Noah Barker show at La Das. What's the, what's the collective now? Don't move that. No, shut up. Well, this is like uh, bottom of the fish tank. That's fish tank seed. Wait, so you plant two of those, you wait six months. Fuck you. <laughs> What's called? Don't mean it necessarily grows anything. Except for happiness for the fish's life to have a little color. I feel, I feel confused. I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm trying to learn about this man. Apparently, it's something to do with this man. Maybe these seeds are supposed to be cocaine. And tell me. This is clearly this guy. Yeah. Saying that after doing cocaine, yeah. his life was as fucked as he <laughs> As somebody has been now to about, I would say, seven art galleries, I know Between for a fact this has nothing to do with all that. <laughs> you know what I also don't know? What this thing has to do with phone? I like that. I mean, I don't get how it relates to that, but I, but I get that if you put that on top of that, it could be a bitch. By the way, they're not, they're not. What did you say? Fish tank seeds? Because a, that's not a thing. They are in fact crushed oy oyster shells. Which would make complete friggin' sense because oysters at the bottom of the ocean, which are kind of like little fish tank seeds. God, I'm smart. Oysters are an aphrodisiac. Yeah, once you eat a couple of them shells, yeah. No, but they're crushed up. So and coke takes away your libido. Cocaine takes away your libido. So what? I don't know. I'm not into drugs. I give it one thumb up. She gives it the shitty blood sign. Four, I think we give this four blood signs up. I, my hands hurt. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I can't be in a gang. Two of my special needs kids had the best argument last week. I don't know, something happened. The bigger kid with a list goes, you're just so stupid. And then the spazzy kid looks at him and is like, Arr! I think you're just meaner than a hippopotamus. <laughs> the lispy kid goes, well, I would like to say thank you very much. Because I happen to think hippopotamus are very lovely and docile animals. Oh. And then the spazzy kid freaks out and goes, Arr! you don't know anything about hippopotamus. Do you have any idea how many African people they kill every year? <laughs> and I'm just thinking, damn, they struggle with stuff. But my students know a shit ton about hippopotamuses. <laughs>